Hi everyone, this is exam topic covered in 3 minutes and in this video we are covering a very important topic that is microRNAs. What are microRNAs? They are small 21 to 22 nucleotide length single stranded RNAs. Now I will just show you this image and explain what is this. Now first and foremost we understand that this microRNAs are not exogenous, they are produced by a microRNA gene. And first what is produced is not directly a microRNA, it is initially a dry microRNA with the cap and the tail and later on it is undergoing certain modifications and later it becomes pre microRNAs. This is exported out and then it is trimmed by certain enzymes which are called as dicer and we will get a double stranded microRNA first and this is unwound and it is loaded to a machine which is called as RISC. RISC. What is RISC? It is RNA induced silencing complex. So just think about a spider in a cobweb which is waiting for its prey. So just like that this microRNAs are loaded into the cobweb which is called as RNA induced silencing complex. Now what is the function of this microRNAs? These microRNAs even though they are small they can bind with the 3 prime untranslated region of an mRNA. So you can see here in this picture this can bind with the 3 prime untranslated translated region. Now when this pair it can be a perfect pairing or an imperfect pairing but whatever is it if it's a perfect pairing this is going to cleave this mRNA just like the spider eating the, uh, the small flies or if it is an uh, imperfect pairing between the S, uh, miRNA and the mRNA then also it is not going to leave this mRNA this will arrest the translation of this mRNA right. So functionally what is the net effect of it? This is a gene silencing otherwise this is called gene knockdown otherwise called as RNA interference and this regulation of gene expression is a post transcriptional regulation of gene expression. Okay. Now you will ask me this question what is siRNA? siRNA is small interfering RNA. In the definition and in the mechanism of action it is the same. It has risk loading, it, it combines with the 3 prime untranslated regions of the mRNA. Everything is the same. Gene knockdown, everything is the same. But the difference in the case of siRNA is they are not endogenously produced. They are exogenous. This is the difference in the case of siRNA. So that is in short about siRNA and miRNA. Thank you for watching and follow for more. Bye bye. Stay blessed.